So we're at nice and tall, our feet are this distance apart. Tighten those abdominals, so belly button goes into your spine. Concentrate on those lower abdominals. So you want to tighten those two and then pelvic floor will tighten and then you want to tighten your waist, trying to make that a little bit smaller. Making sure we breathe into our ribs, so our ribs expand and not our tummies. And deep inhale. And exhale, chin to chest as we slowly roll down. Inhale. And exhale, slowly curling up, tilting the pubic bone forward as we are rolling up. And press shoulders back. Inhale. And exhale, slowly control it down. Belly button into the spine. Try to keep your legs straight and press tailbone to the ceiling so those hamstrings get a good stretch. Align through the knees so head is relaxed. Inhale. And exhale, slowly curling up. Belly button into the spine. Grow nice and tall from the crown of the head. Inhale. And exhale, slowly curling down. Loosening up the spine, stretching those hamstrings, relaxing arms, relaxing head. Inhale. And exhale, using those abdominals to restack the spine. And press shoulders back. Inhale and exhale slowly curling down. Inhale and exhale slowly rolling up. Go nice and tall. We go into calf raises. So we inhale, reaching arms up, coming up as high as you can onto those toes. Inhale here and exhale, slowly control it down. Inhale and exhale, keeping belly button into the spine, tilting pubic bone a little bit forward, and tuck your ribs in. Inhale. And exhale, slowly curl. Inhale. And exhale. Reaching up nice and high. Keep shoulders out of your ears. Inhale. And exhale, slowly lowering back down. Inhale. And exhale. Inhale. And exhale, slowly we lower back down. Inhale, exhale, reaching up. Belly button to the spine, tighten those quads, inhale. And exhale, slowly down. Last one, inhale. And exhale, reaching up. Keeping the arms up, inhale, and exhale, slowly lower the heels. We inhale, reach over to the right into a nice side bend, feeling the left side of the body stretch. Use that left oblique to exhale and return to the center. Inhale, reaching over to the left. Exhale and return. Inhale, reach over to the right. Really lengthen with that left arm. Exhale and return. Inhale, over to the left. Exhale and return. One more on each side. Inhale, reaching over to the right. Exhale and return. And over to the left. And slowly return. Bring those arms back down next to your sides. We're going to go into a squat and then into a lunge. So open a little bit wider with the legs. 
and you can just have your hands on your hips. So we're going to do a little squat. So really send those glutes behind you and then we come up. Then you're going to turn to the right, twisting those feet so you can come down into a lunge. Making sure you're not leaning forward. We are pressing back and you till the pubic bone forward. We come up to the front and we do a little squat. And then we turn to the left and we squat. Oh, sorry, we lunge and then to the front for a squat. And then to the right for a lunge. And then we squat. And we lunge. We just try to get that back knee down. And coming up. And we squat. As our in back stays nice and tall. And we squat. Pressing knees back. And we lunge. And we squat. Keep tilting pubic bone forward. Abs are in. Waking up those legs, waking up those glutes. And we squat back up tall. Ribs are pressing in. And lunge. And we squat. And we lunge. Now hold this lunge. And we're going to tiny little pulses for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Come to the center and squat, pressing knees back, tilting pubic bone forward. We pulse down for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. One, and then we turn to the left in our lunge. Little pulses. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and we come up. Bring the feet closer. We're just going to go into a quick little quad stretch. So grabbing the right foot. And I want you to press your tailbone forward and bring the leg back. So you get into a nice quad stretch. Think about bringing that foot up towards your head to increase that stretch while you're tilting the pubic bone forward. Making sure you're not sitting into your one hip. We're growing nice and tall. And then gently lower it down, change legs. Pressing cubic bone forward, belly button stays into your spine. And then we place it down and then we're going to go into a Pilates push-up. So you're going to start at the, top, the bottom of your mat. Feet are a little bit wider than fist distance. Inhale, exhale, chin to chest as you slowly curl down. Now we walk our hands forward into a plank. You want to try a walk forward in three walks. So we've got one, two, and three. If you need to, you are very welcome to put your knees down and do ladies push-ups. But keep in mind, we are only doing three. So we inhale lower, bending those arms, and exhale, we press up. Keep tilting pubic bone forward. And we inhale down for two. Elbows hug the sides of your body. And exhale, we press up. Last one for three. And we press up. Then you walk your hands back again in three walks. And then you roll back up. Up tall, shoulders back. Inhale. And exhale, slowly curl down, belly button into the spine, tailbone reaching to the ceiling. 
And you'll look forward in three steps. One, two, three. Make sure your hands, your fingers are open nice and wide. Pressing into those fingertips. And we inhale, lower. And we exhale, press up. And we lower down, two. And we press up. Lower down, three. And we press up, we walk back. One, two, three. Inhale and exhale, we roll up. Inhale. And exhale, curling down. Align through those knees. And then we walk forward. One, two, three. And we inhale, lower. Exhale, press up. Elbows hug the body. Down, two. And up. Down, three. And up, we walk back. One, two, three. And then we exhale and we roll up. One more of these. Inhale. And exhale, cooling down. Walk forward, one, two, three. And we push up, inhale down. Exhale up, down two. And up, last one for three. And up, and then just lower those knees down. Knees underneath hips, hands underneath shoulders for cat stretch. We inhale, lift the head, lengthening the spine, chest through the arms. And exhale, curl chin to chest, rounding the spine up to the ceiling. And we inhale, lengthen and extend. Press shoulders down your back, arching the spine if it feels nice on the back. And we exhale and curl. Inhale, lengthen and extend. Exhale, curl. Use those abdominals. Inhale, lengthen and extend. Exhale, curl. Now just return your spine to neutral. Keeping those abs in. We lift opposite arm and leg. So we inhale, lift right arm, left leg. Making sure you're not arching your back. So keep tilting pubic bone forward, abs are in. And slowly we place it down. We change sides. Inhale, lengthen up. And exhale, we place it down. Pressing away from the floor so we're not sitting in our shoulders. Inhale, right arm and left leg. And exhale, we place it down. Inhale, lengthen. And exhale, lower. Inhale, reaching up. Exhale, place it down. Inhale, up. Exhale, lower. Inhale, lift right arm, left leg. Hold it here. Making sure we tilting pubic bone forward. Flex that back foot. Pulse just up, leg up to the ceiling. We lift for eight. Feel that glute. Seven. Six. Five. So if you're lifting too high, you're going into your back. We just want the glute to be working. Two, one, hold it here, now bend that leg. So without arching that back, so you're still tilting pubic bone forward, pressing with the heel, we press to the ceiling. Four, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. We place arm and leg down. And then we lift left arm, right leg. Hold it there. 
Shoulders are still out of our ears. We are still tilting cubic bone forward. Abs are in. We flex that foot and we pulse up. Four, eight, seven, six, five. Squeeze that feet. Four, three, two, one. And then we're going to bend that leg. Making sure still we're not arching into our back, we pulse up. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one, and we place it down. Now just for fun, we're going to see if you can balance with same arm, same leg. So we're going to reach right arm and right leg up. And we balance. Four, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. And we place it down and then other side. Left, left, arm and left leg. And we hold eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one, and we place it down. I want you to make a round C shape with your spine. So you're going to take your glutes and your head over to the right, as if you want your glutes and your head to touch. Just hold that stretch, nice stretch into the left side of the body. And then we return to the center. And then over to the left, head and glute, trying to touch on the left side. And then slowly return. And then I want you to come onto your side. You're gonna be on your elbow. Top leg is straight. And then you've got two options. Either you're gonna keep the bottom leg bent and you're gonna lift up, pressing up onto that bottom knee, or else you're gonna straighten both the legs. All we're gonna do is lift and hover, lift and hover, using that bottom oblique. Okay. So whichever is best for your body, we press away from the floor so we're not sitting into the shoulder. Press those ribs away. Abs are in, reach top arm long. We're gonna do eight of them, okay. So we exhale, we lift hips up. So you really wanna lift up nice and high, so you really work that oblique. And then we hover it, and we press up two, and we hover it. Press up three, and we hover. Press up four, and hover. Press up five, and hover. Press up six, belly button into your spine. Press up seven, hover. Last one up, we hold for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and all the way down. And then we go over to the other side. Making sure our elbow is underneath the shoulder. Press away from the floor. Abs are in. And top arm reaches long. And we lift. And then we hover. Lift two. And hover. Lift three. And hover. Reach up four. And hover, abs are in, up five, and hover, four, six, and hover, four, seven, hover, four, eight, hold, four, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and come all the way down. We're going to sit up onto those boots. 
a legs are bent. We're going to extend our left leg. Try to keep your thighs in line but not squeezing together. Reaching your arms next to your sides. Press shoulders down and I want you to point into that left foot. We inhale. We exhale and we slowly control it down. One vertebra at a time. Our left leg stays lifted so it stays in line with the right thigh. Reach the arms back making sure our ribs are pressing down. We come all the way up. If you can't, you just come up to where you can. Inhale, arms move for two. Exhale, we curl all the way up. Chest through the arms, inhale. And exhale, we slowly curl down. Use those abdominals, ribs pressing to the mat as you reach the arms back. Inhale, arms move to the ceiling for two. And we exhale up. Shoulders out of your ears, inhale. And exhale, slowly curl down. We're just gonna do four on the side. Inhale, arms move for three. And exhale up. Let back at the top, so chest through the arms, inhale. And exhale, slowly curl down. Last one on this side, inhale, arms move for four. And exhale up. Now we hold it here, flex that left foot. And we're gonna lower it to hover, and we're gonna lift it up. We lift to hover for two. We lift up and down for three. Reach up for four. Reach up for five. Reach for six. Abs are in for seven. And last one for eight. Hold. And then bend that leg, place it down, and then we extend the right leg, we point that foot, inhale. And we exhale, slowly curl down. Reaching the arms back. Inhale, arms move to the ceiling. And we exhale up. Inhale. And exhale, slowly down, one vertebra at a time. Ribs press down as you reach arms back. Inhale, arms move for two. Sink those abdominals and we exhale up. Inhale. And exhale, slowly curl down. Inhale, arms move for three. Exhale up. Relax those shoulders, inhale. And exhale down. Last one, inhale, arms move for four. Exhale up. And hold it here, chest through the arms, abs are in. We flex that foot and we inhale, lower it to hover. And we exhale, reach it up. We lower it to hover for two and we reach it up. Down for three and we reach it up. Down for four, reach it up. For five and up. Lower for six and for seven and last one for eight and hold it and then you can bend that leg, place it down, inhale. We exhale, curl down, leaving your hands down next to your sides, slide your heels a little bit closer and lift your heels off the mat. So toes are pressing down, so we're in a nice calf raise, making sure those knees stay fist distance. We inhale, 
exhale, scoop through the pelvis, lifting the hips up one vertebra at a time. Press down with those shoulders. Feel those glutes, feel those hamstrings, inhale. And exhale from the top of the spine, we slowly curl down. Nice and slow and controlled. Inhale. And exhale slowly up. Tighten those abdominals, transferring the knees towards the feet. At the top, think about bringing your sternum a little bit closer to the chest and you feel that lower back activate. Inhale. And exhale, slowly curling back down. Really try to lengthen your spine down along the mat. Inhale. Exhale, we flatten the back. Scoop through the pelvis as we slowly lift. Are those knees still fist distance apart? So you work those inner thighs. Inhale. And exhale, slowly lengthening down. Inhale. Exhale, curling up, tighten those abdominals, squeeze those glutes. Now from here, we're going to do little quick pulses. So we lower the hips, we squeeze up, lower two, and squeeze. Three, glutes don't touch the floor. Four, five, six, seven, and eight. Now, little, little one. So you barely lower. Little lower and squeeze. Little lower. Squeeze. Really squeeze those glutes. Three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. We inhale and exhale, slowly curl down. I want you to keep lower back pressing into the mat. Take your arms to your palms facing the ceiling. Float right leg to tabletop and float left leg to tabletop. We squeeze our knees together, we point into the feet. Try it. Sink those lower abdominals a little bit more. We inhale and we take our legs over to the right, making sure those knees stay together and they stay level with each other. From here, we exhale, we straighten the legs. Inhale, we bend. Use that left oblique and your breath to exhale and return the legs to the center. We inhale over to the left, making sure right arm and shoulder blades stay on the mat. Exhale, straighten the legs. Inhale, bend. And exhale, we return to the center. Inhale over to the right, lengthening with the left hip so the knees stay level. Exhale, straighten the legs. Our feet are pointed and we bend the legs. Sink those abdominals as you exhale and return to the center. Inhale over to the left. Exhale, straighten. Inhale, bend. And exhale, we return to the center. One more on each side. Inhale over to the right. Exhale, straighten. Inhale, bend. And exhale, return to the center. Last one over to the left. Exhale, straighten. Inhale, bend. And slowly to the center. Keeping the legs in tabletop if you can. If not, you can place the feet on the floor. We circle arms around into lace the fingers and hands come behind our head. Inhale. Exhale up into a chest lift, sliding your ribs down to your hip bones, trying to get shoulder blades off the mat. Hold and inhale, and exhale slowly, lower all the way down. Keeping that belly button into the spine, inhale. 
Exhale, lengthen up with two. Pressing your head a little bit back into the hands. Inhale. And exhale, slowly contract it down. Inhale. Exhale up for three. Make sure those shoulders are relaxed. Inhale. And exhale, slowly down. Inhale. Exhale, lengthen up for four. Elbows are just in your peripheral vision. Inhale. And exhale down. Inhale. Exhale, lengthen up for five. Try to deepen those abdominals a little bit more. Tighten pelvic floor. Inhale. And exhale, slowly control it down. Inhale. Exhale, slowly up. Sliding those ribs down, pointing to those feet. Inhale. And exhale, slowly down. Inhale. Exhale, lengthen up. From here, we're going to do tiny little ones. So we inhale lower, just a little, and we exhale left for one. Inhale lower. Exhale up two. Inhale lower. Exhale up three. Inhale lower. Exhale up four. Inhale lower. Exhale up five. Inhale lower. Exhale up six. Inhale lower. Exhale up seven. Inhale lower. Up for eight. Now we hold it here. Our pelvis and our legs stay nice and still as we inhale. And exhale, rotate the upper body over to the right. And then just pass the outside of that right thigh. And then we slowly return to the centre, keeping the height of the chest. And then we exhale over to the left. Inhale, return. Sinking those abdominals. Exhale to the right. Inhale through the center. And exhale over to the left. Inhale, we return. And exhale to the right. Hips are still. Inhale, we return. And we go all the way over to the left. Inhale, return. Now we try to speed it up a little bit. To the right and to the left. Slow it back down again if your hips are moving. Keep going. Keep sinking those lower abdominals. Remember to tighten pelvic floor. Elbows stay wide, just in your peripheral vision. Last one on each side. To the right. And to the left. Now return to the centre. Reach your arms up to the ceiling and try to lift it up a little bit higher. And then open arms to the T, lowering the head down to the mat. Lengthen your left leg down along the mat point into that foot. Straighten the right leg and flex that foot. If you're struggling to keep this right leg straight, so if your back is taking strain, bend that left leg slightly. We want to work this inner thigh and we're trying to keep our hips as still as possible. We inhale, exhale, circle the leg towards the body and then down and around for one. Inhale, exhale, we circle two and we circle three. Pressing that heel up to the ceiling and we circle four. Exhale, circle five. Inhale. Exhale, circle six. Exhale, circle seven. Deepen those abdominals. We circle eight and reverse. Inhale. Exhale, circle away from the body. Down and around for one. Exhale, circle two. Circle three. Exhale, circle four. Circle five. Press with that heel. Circle six. Circle seven, and last one for eight. From here, just 
Point that right foot, lower it all the way down to the mat. Slide the left leg up to tabletop. And then we straighten it up to the ceiling and we flex. Sink those abdominals. Make sure shoulders are relaxed. Inhale. Exhale, circle leg towards the body, down and around for one. Exhale, circle two. Keep it torso nice and still we circle three. Exhale, circle four. Exhale, circle five. Circle six. Circle seven. And last one for eight. We reverse it. Is that leg still straight? Inhale. Exhale, circle away from the body, down and around for one. And circle two, pressing with the heel. Circle three. Exhale, circle four. Exhale, circle five. Circle six. Circle seven. And last one for eight. Point into that foot, bend into that leg and just place the foot down, bend. And then bend the right leg up to join it. We're going to open our knees out to the side and we're going to press our soles of our feet together. You can just let the knees hang there for now. You might get into a nice hip stretch here if you're nice and tight. And then you're going to circle the arms around and lace the fingers and hands come behind your head. I want you to press your lower back into the mat. To do that, you might need to lift the knees up slightly. Just as long as that lower back is down and you are really tightening those abdominals. We're going to do a chest lift here. So we inhale. Exhale, coming up into a chest lift. Again, pressing head a little bit back into our hands. Deepen those abdominals a little bit more, little pulses. We inhale, lower a little bit. And we exhale, press up one. Inhale, lower. Exhale, press up two. Inhale, lower. We press up three. Inhale, lower. Press up four. Inhale, lower. Up for five, inhale lower. Up six, inhale lower. Up seven, inhale lower. Up for eight. Now hold it here again, pelvis, stay still. We inhale, exhale, rotate the body to the right. And inhale to the center. Exhale over to the left. Inhale to the center. Exhale to the right. Inhale to the center. Exhale to the left. Inhale, return. Exhale over to the right. Inhale, return. Over to the left. And return. Now reach arms behind you and lower the head and the arms down. Little and pelvic curls, we inhale. Exhale, we slowly curl up. So soles of the feet are still together, knees are still open wide, inhale. And exhale, really lengthen the spine as you curl down. Inhale. Exhale, flatten the back. Tilt pubic bone up and lift those hips. Glutes should be working a little bit more here. Inhale. And exhale, slowly curl down. Inhale. Exhale, slowly up. Belly bites into the spine. Pressing hips nice and high. Squeeze those glutes. Inhale. And exhale, slowly curl down. Inhale. Exhale, up, belly bites into the spine. Inhale, and exhale, curl down. Now from here, we're going to try and roll up. If you're struggling to roll up, you just take your feet a little bit further away. The soles of the feet are still together. Knees are still open out to the side. Inhale, lifting the arms, followed by the head and chest. Deepen those abdominals and use your breath. As you wait, how 
Inhale and exhale slowly curl down one vertebra at a time. Ribs pressing down as those arms reach back. Inhale, lifting arms, head and chest. Exhale, curl up, press shoulders out of your ears. Inhale. And exhale, slowly we curl down. Keep tilting pubic bone up towards the ceiling so you can get into those abdominals a little bit more. Inhale, lifting arms, head and chest. And exhale. Inhale. And exhale slowly. Cool down. Last one. Inhale, lifting arms, hidden chest. And exhale. Staying in this position, you're just going to bring your heels closer to the body. Grab onto those toes. And then you're going to take your tailbone and press it behind you. And you're going to try and get your elbows to touch the mat. Relaxing the head, just hold that hip stretch. And then slowly we come up, straighten the legs in front of you, squeezing the legs together and flex your feet. Chest through the arms, reach your arms up to the ceiling. We inhale. Exhale, we're just going to fold forward. Hold it there, inhale. And exhale, we slowly curl back, restacking our spine. You can circle the arms around. Reaching them back up to the ceiling. Chest is through the arms. Back extensors are working. Abs are working. We inhale. Exhale, we fold forward. Reaching with the crown of the head. Arms stay in line with the shoulders. Your head can relax. Inhale. And exhale, we slowly restack the spine. Circling the arms around. Reaching up to the ceiling. Inhale, we exhale and we fold forward. So stretch into the hamstrings, maybe even the calves, and maybe even back and neck. Inhale. And exhale, we restack the spine. Growing tall on an inhale as you reach the arms up. And exhale, we fold forward. Those feet are flexed. Inhale. Exhale, we slowly curl back up one vertebra at a time. Inhale, reaching on to growing tall. Last one. Exhale, we fold forward. Hold it, inhale. And exhale, slowly curl back up, restacking the spine. And reach the arms up. Hold it here. We want to keep our pelvis and our legs still as we inhale. Exhale, we twist to the right. So we're just twisting from that waist. And then we inhale and we return to the center. We exhale, twist to the left. So if your legs are moving, you're moving from those hips. And inhale to center. Exhale to the right. Inhale to the center. Abs are in, you're growing nice and tall. And exhale over to the left. Inhale, return. Exhale to the right. Deepen those abdominals. Inhale to the center. Last one, over to the left. And return to the center. We inhale. Exhale, we're curling down, leaving our hands next to our sides and we're bending our legs. Feet and knees are first distance apart. Inhale. 
Exhale, scooping through the pelvis, lifting the hips up one vertebra at a time. From here, we're going to lift and lower just the right hip. So you're going to lower the right hip towards the floor. And exhale, you press it back up. We're using that right glute to press it back up. And we lower the hip down two. And we press it back up. We lower right hip again for three. And we press it up. Lower it for four. And we press it up. Lower it for five. And press it up. Down for six. And press it up. Lower it for seven. Press it up. Lower it for eight and press it up. Now left hip, you lower left hip and you press it up. Lower it for two and press it up. Lower it for three and press it up. Lower it for four and press it Down for five and press up, abs are in, down for six, and press up, down for seven, press it up, last one for eight, and press it up, hips are up nice and high, we squeeze our left glutes, our left hamstring, our left inner thigh, we gently float right leg up, and then we straighten it and we point that foot. We inhale, lower that leg down towards the mat. And we exhale and we flex it back up. We inhale, point down two. Flex up, left glute should be working. We point down three and we flex it up. We point down for four. We flex it up. Point down for five and flex up. Point down for six. Flex up, shoulders relax. Point down for seven. Flex up. Last one for eight. We flex up. Bend that leg, we place it down. Make sure those hips are still nice and high. And then we squeeze our right glutes, our right hamstring, our right inner thigh. We float left leg up without lowering the hip. We straighten that leg, we point that foot. And we inhale, lower the leg down towards the mat. And we exhale and we flex up. Point it down for two. Flex up, feeling that right leg working. We point down three. And we flex up. Point it down for four. And we flex up. Point down for five. Flex up. Point down for six. And flex up. Point down for seven. We flex up. Last one for eight. And flex up. Bend the leg to tabletop. We place it down and then we inhale. And exhale slowly. Curl down. If you feel you need to, you can just quickly hug knees into the chest. But hopefully you didn't feel that in your back. Hopefully those glutes were working. And then you're just going to turn over onto your side. Bottom arm is long, palm facing the ceiling. Rest your head down onto that arm. If you can, top arm comes onto your thigh. If not, just in front of your belly button for support. Toes are just a tiny bit in front. If you look down, you should just be able to see those toes. Sink that belly button. Try to lift the waist. We're going to lift upper body and the legs using this top oblique. So we inhale. Exhale, lift upper body and those legs. Keep heels squeezing and we slowly lower. And we exhale up for two. Inhale, lower. Exhale up for three. Slowly lower. Up for four. Slowly lower, keeping belly button into the spine. And we reach up for five. Slowly lower. 
Lifting up for six and slowly up. Up for seven, slowly lower. And last one up for eight and lower. We bend into the bottom leg. We're going to do my favorite and we're going to do it a little bit quicker today. So I want those abs in and I want your waist lifted off the mat so there's a little bit of a space. Okay, the foot's just relaxed and we're going to lift up to the ceiling for one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. We bring that leg to the front without moving the torso. We lift it up to the ceiling, we lower it and we take it back. Forward, up, down, inhale back for two. Inhale back. Three. Don't let the waist collapse. Four. Five. Up, down, and back. Four. Six. Up, down, back. Seven. Up, down, back. Four. Eight. Up, down. Keep it behind. We pulse it up. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two, one. We bring it to the front and we tap onto the floor. Inhale, two, three, four. Exhale, two, three, four, five. Inhale, two, three, four. Exhale, two, three, four, five. Inhale, is it working? Exhale, two, three, four, five. Inhale, two, three, four. Exhale, two, three, four, five. Last inhale, two, three, four. Exhale, two, three. Four, five, relax. You can come up, give that leg a quick stretch, but if you just work, cross it over and just pull it in. Try to keep both sitting bones down and just hold that stretch. It does feel a little bit worse before it feels better. And then other side. Okay, so first our legs are straight, but um, arm is straight, palm up to the ceiling, lift the waist, belly button to the spine. We inhale, legs, high lift upper body and the legs. Squeeze and heels together and slow lower. And we exhale up two. And we inhale lower. Exhale up for three. Slowly lower, deepen those abdominals and we reach up for four. Slowly down. Up for five. Slowly down. And reaching up for six. Slowly lower. Up for seven. Slowly down, reaching up for eight, and down. We bend the bottom leg, make sure you lift the waist, keep it lifted, abs are in. So top leg foot is just relaxed, slight bend in, in the knee. Abs are in, we lift up. One, two, three, four, five, six, Seven, eight. We bring it forward, lift up, lower, take it back. Forward, up, down, and back. Three. Torso stay nice and still. Four. Five. Keeping belly button to the spine. Six. Up, down, and back. For seven. Inhale back. For eight. And we keep it back, we pulse it up. Eight. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. We bring it to the front. We pulse down. Inhale, two, three, four. Exhale, two, three, four, five. Inhale, two, three, four. Exhale, two, three, four, five. Inhale, two, three, four. Exhale, two, three, four, five. Inhale, two, three, four. Exhale, two, three. 
four, last inhale, two, three, four, exhale, two, three, four, five, come up, give it a quick stretch. Keeping both sitting bones down. And then we're going to come onto our stomachs. And you're going to make sure you're squeezing those arms tightly against your side. So not wrapped around your back, not resting on the floor. So side seams of your pants. Squeeze so tightly that there isn't a space between your body and those arms. Keeping the belly button into the spine and eye line on the mat, we just lift up the body. So we inhale, lengthen up, squeezing shoulder blades. So back muscles are working and we exhale, lower. Inhale, we lengthen up for two. Exhale, down. Inhale, up for three. Think about belly button to your spine and slowly down. Inhale, we lengthen up for four. Squeeze those arms. Exhale, lower. Inhale, up for five. Slowly down. Inhale, up for six. Slowly lower. Inhale, up for seven. Slowly down. Up for eight. Now we hold it here. We're going to reach right hand down towards the right knee. So we're doing like a side bend. And we inhale, return to the center. Exhale, reaching over to the left. Inhale, return. I line still on the mat. Exhale to the right. Inhale, return. Keeping chest lifted. And we exhale over to the left. Inhale, we return. Exhale to the right. Inhale, return. Over to the left. And return one more on each side. Over to the right. And return. Last one to the left. And return. Bring your arms to the front and then just rest your forehead down onto your hands. We're squeezing our legs together and we're pressing our pubic bone into the mat. Try to keep straight legs and we inhale, lift just the legs up. And exhale, we lower. Inhale, up for two, belly button still into your spine. And slowly lower. I want the glutes to be working more than your lower back. So really press pubic bone down. We lift up three. And slowly lower. We lift up four. And slowly lower. We reach up for five. Slowly lower. Lifting up for six. And lower. We reach up for seven. Slowly lower. Last one up for eight. And lower. Now straighten your arms in front. Last exercise. Slow swimming to start. So we lift opposite arm and leg. Not so much about height, more about lengthening. So we inhale, lift right arm, left leg and upper body. As if somebody's trying to pull you apart. And slowly place it down. At the side, inhale, reaching up. Exhale, lower. Inhale up, making sure your pelvis is staying still. We don't want you rocking from side to side. Slowly lower. Inhale, lengthen up. Exhale down, belly button into the spine. Inhale, we're reaching up. Exhale, lower. Inhale, reaching up. 
Exhale, lower. Inhale, reaching up. Exhale, lower. Inhale, up. And lower. If you want, you can stay doing the slow version. Or else we lift everything up. Arms, legs, upper body, and we swim. Inhale for one. And exhale. Inhale for two. And exhale, belly button into your spine. Inhale for three. And exhale, pelvis is still. Shoulders out of your ears. Inhale for four. And exhale. Inhale for five. And exhale. Last time for six. And exhale. And resting down. Slide your hands to midrib, exhale, press yourself up onto all fours. Tuck your toes under and just cat stretch, so chin to chest, curl spine up to the seat. Just hold it there. Tilting pubic bone forward so you can get into that lower back. Hold and breathe. And then you can untuck the toes. Big toes come together. Open the knees a little bit wider and press the, the glutes back onto your heels. Still with the back rounded. Hold it there. And then slide your hands forward, lowering your chest towards the mat. And just hold it there and breathe in child's pose. And then when you feel ready, slowly curl back up, sit up tall, press shoulders back. And then that's our session for this morning. Thanks for joining.